let's understand the difference between sql concept distinct group by what's the difference here it is let's have a table on my screen you have a table like this country wise state wise city wise population we report only country select only country no you don't want the repeated country values you want only unique countries then we can make use of distinct then comes something called group by both are same distinct and group by both are same gives you unique values one main difference one main difference between these two see right now it's both are same country and district one main difference aggregation group by gives us more flexibility for example you would like to have country wise total population country comma sum of population so group by gives you unique plus aggregate distant gives only say only unique no aggregations group by gives you both yes are we getting it please i'll wait yes yes, yes. other i'll wait yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Great. Yep. Now, how to report? How to report country-wise, state-wise, city-wise population? There is a small rule we need to follow to work with group by. We are understanding distinct, unique, group by, unique. plus aggregate this one when working with group by we have a small rule to follow let me put this way here whenever whenever we need aggregations based on based on columns we generally say category columns then we need to use group by this is the first thing what i said a rule right here it is whenever we use group by then the columns used in select should be either used in group by or should be aggregated what does it mean for example see here which columns i am using in select three columns country state population columns used in select three columns are used in select they should be either in group by or in aggregate this won't work why because state is neither in aggregation nor in group by see table state table population dot state you remember this previous classes previous chapter joins concept we learnt remember table name dot column name yes, yes. you remember please chapter yes, 7 table name dot column yep. name yep yes fine it's all about a dot b table name dot column name now in our group by concept we are learning that population table state column it's invalid here why because it should be contained it should be contained either in aggregate or in group by but state is neither in aggregate nor in group by so we get error come on give a guess we are very new to our sql let's enjoy it tell me please how to correct this problem 
please read the error carefully come on you please try i'll wait please yes mike with everyone please try i'll wait alter table sir no dear no no see alter table is for structure but right now we are reporting the data right we are reporting you need to add the group yes what we have to do see every uh, column in select should be either in group by or in aggregate what you have to do we need to we need to add in group by exactly uh, we have to add in group by country state yeah are we getting it please everyone sayed others please are we getting it please i'll wait yes yes sir got it got it or or for example you would like to have number of states so count of state like this there should be either aggregate or directly used in group by either of them it should be there are we getting it please now i'll wait yes 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 fine got it so remember the rule whenever we use group by whatever columns in group by will be in select remaining columns remaining columns will be either in aggregate or should be additionally added to group by simply put this way the rule columns used in select should be in group by columns used in select should be in group by or aggregate that's it okay from okay, here comes our next items like for example roll ups cubes etc separately any questions here let me know the basic fundamental item i'll wait no fine until yeah clear sir fine dear fine others please i'll wait um if are... go ahead uh, um if you are um aggregating the column name we don't have to group by it right exactly or sister oh. you're right yeah you're right either okay. in group by or in aggregate okay either one of them should be fine for example population is aggregated so i don't use it in group by state is aggregated so i don't use it in group by yes you're right yes oh. okay so remember this rule i shall uh, include this information in the mail anyway fine let's continue our next title right. tell me tell me tell me dear yeah samir uh, here in uh, if you write uh, in the 49 statement here if yeah. you write count of country right then uh, we no need to use that group by at all right because Not the same right. information is given exactly you are right yes. see if everything is in aggregate if everything is in a then group by not useful then group by is not required let me just remove this one and show you again right and we know how to define the column names right everyone you remember column aliases right isn't it as, as uh, country yeah. count yeah. right something like this. as yeah as exactly chapter 4 alias yes samir hope it is clear samir let me know yeah clear yeah. okay Fine. Just the rules. Okay, apply the rule carefully. That's it. Yep. Fine. Let's continue our next item. So first, you practice this group by concept carefully. The basics. Please practice the basics part carefully first. Previous class we learnt joins basics. You remember that everyone? Please. Yes. Hope you practice over the weekend. Joins basics. Yes. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes. So earlier yes, we learnt. joins basics constraints and this one joins we did only two tables right isn't it two table joins we did now yes sir yes now let's mix everything together and understand next level queries the actual recipe so far it's only the ingredients now comes actual recipe 
let's understand i think over the weekend i gave you some uh, advanced some queries to you right reference queries you remember that please yes yes sir. them ask queries yeah yep yes sir yes amazon database example let's go there carefully let's mix joins with group by let's mix joins with group by carefully here just wait for a few moments we'll take it from there yes 